What's going on YouTube? It's your boy OGT Man, and today, <clears throat> my bad. I'm gonna still give y'all energy. I'm just tired, but I've been working, had fun yesterday. But we back to the grind today. We got video by who? Bryce Fitz called XXL in 2024. It's a joke. Now, I seen certain people that was on the cipher, XSL cipher. I ain't gonna lie. Don't know um, Don't even know if the shit gonna be hit or not. But, um, without that being said, hold up. Focus, bastard. My bad, y'all. But, without that being said, let's get to the video. Hi, right, guys. This is Bryce, and we're back with another video. In today's video, I'm talking about the 2024 freshman class and, and why this shit just it just don't matter no more it just don't matter but in this video we're gonna take it serious all right we're gonna pretend like it matters in this video i'm gonna go over all the 10th spot choices and my ideal list of who i think should make the freshman class so without further ado i'm on the website here i don't know what this merch is they're promoting this is some bullshit bro i ain't even gonna lie i who who bought who's buying that we have the 10th spot vote here so i'm gonna go through each and every person here give you my thoughts about it and then at the end i got my ideal perfect world list of what the list should look like if people actually care about xxl anymore so without further ado let's get right into it so the 10th spot here alphabetical order starting out here i'll be all i don't know i don't know who this is anisia listen anisia is one of my favorite artists period not even female artists coming up she is going to end up on the list of who I think should make the, the XXL thing regardless, but I want to put her in. I'm just let y'all know, nine times out of ten, I don't know most of these people. Um, eh, hey, they have Cypher. They ain't really been. I ain't really been hearing nothing about them ever since 2016 freshman class. After that, 2017 and over, I listened, but after 2021, that's why I really just like, do anybody really care about it? So, yeah, let's just see. I like seeing her in here. I like seeing her in here a lot. And then we have Baby Drill. Baby Drill's so far. Baby Drill's so far. I don't think he's going to yeah, make yeah. the XXL class. I don't think he quite fits. But Baby Drill is very fire. So is Baby Facey. Another one coming out of Detroit. Extremely fire. I've seen him live before. I love Baby Facey. I don't think he's making the list, though. I, I really don't. Baby Kia. I think he's making the list, and I think he should make the list. I think he's big enough to a point. He's been having a crazy moment with his head exploding and shit. I don't even know, but he should probably make the list. Big homie G, I don't know who that is. Big X of plugs, probably should make the list. I mean, I, I think he's up there, and I know a lot of these are going to be like, oh, he should probably make the list, and it's going to be way more than 10 people, but just going on a case-by-case, case, I'm giving you my opinion. Big X of plugs has been killing shit. Had a huge year. I could definitely see him on the list. BK the Rula, I would love, love, love to see her on the list. I just don't think she had a big enough year to be on the list. I think she was kind of killing shit a little bit more earlier, but I still love what she's doing, of course. I don't know how to say that. I don't know who that is. BLP Koshin just saw him live. I don't think he's going to be on the list, but he's big enough to where he should be on the list. He has a cult fan base. He's almost one of those artists that surpassed the list, and we're going to run into that later on. But my perfect list isn't... I'm not even going to take into account if they're too big. That's just going to be my perfect list of people who had hard as perfect years boss mandilo one of those people who's gonna be on my list because bro absolutely taken over the world i mean absolutely has taken over the world recently everyone's singing the songs everyone rapping the songs he's one of them ones he's one of them ones breezy lyn i don't know who you are cash cobain now cash cobain has a long-standing history of a lot of shit and i'm not sure if he's gonna make the list but he's been Every week, there's a new feature, a new snippet with some wildly famous artists. I mean, I'm talking Ice Spice, Don Tolliver, Frank Ocean, and even back in the day, the list goes on. Shout out him. Certified Trapper. If Kosher ain't making the list, Certified Trapper ain't making the list. Unfortunately, I do think he kind of would deserve a spot like that, but I'm not sure. We gonna have to wait and see. Chow Lee, I don't know who you are. Connie Diamond, I don't know who you are. D Sturdy, I don't know who you are. FTO Set, I don't know who you are. Gloss Up, I've heard the name. To get started in data analytics. Yeah, so far it's seeming like this this 2024 cipher ain't gonna be shit for real. If they add all these people we Sign don't know. Quality. Well, I don't know. But I don't know who you are. Keen be easy. I don't know who you are. Honcho. Now, Honcho's yep. fire. Honcho's hard. I Honcho need to be on there for a fact. Hon 
Jordan chose me to be on his 2024 XL freshman class. Like, he needs to be on that bitch. No glazing, no none of that. That shit would be fire. I enjoy Honcho's music. I don't think he's quite at the level of the list, though. I don't. But I'll, I'll give him a little shout out right now. Jane Carter, don't know who you are. Caribou, Caribou. If anyone's gonna make it from the from the Concrete Boys, it's Caribou. She has been having a huge year. I could see her making a list. I don't think she'll accept it at all. But that is someone who I'm, I'd, I'd be happy with that. Same with Cash Dami here. I don't think Cash Dami's quite at that level. But he's been killing shit. He's been making quite the name for himself. So I wouldn't be upset at it at all. I wouldn't be upset at it. Moving on, Kenny Mason. Kenny Mason, this list should be a joke to Kenny Mason. He deserves it. But this this list should be a joke. He's way he's way above that. He's, he's way above that in my opinion. Kyle Rich also doing his thing. Doing his thing. I don't think he's going to make it. But he's been making his making his name out in New York. So shout out him. Lay Banks, I don't know who you are. Lil Mabu. <sighs> Low Tony. Now, Low Tony. I could see oh, Low yeah. Tony on the list. Tony's been absolutely killing shit. Doing some new shit, some shit that, you know, has not really been heard, of course, out of Atlanta, out that hub. He's doing his thing. He's killing his things. I don't think he's going to make the list. I think he does deserve it. I just, I don't think he's going to make it. Maya the Dawn, she's been doing great. Uh, she, she's actually been doing great. I don't really listen to her, but she's been doing great. I'll give her a shout out. And of course, Osama Son. That is like the number one, two, like top three spots on the list. Like, he needs to be there. Osama-san will not accept the XXL freshman list, I can almost guarantee. But he should be on there, in my opinion. OT7, Kwani. Kwani deserves it. All right, Kwani, you know how XXL is. They like to get their females in. They like to get their, you know, internet people, their street people in. Kwani would fit right into that little mold. He's been going crazy. I mean, unbelievable interactions. I think he's going to be on the list. Like, I, he's not on my list, but I think he's going to make the list. And I think he deserves it, for sure. Ruben Vincent. Just recently signed a TDE from Charlotte NC, so that's the hometown. So I'm going to show some love there. Room Vince been killing shit, but he not, he not making the list, unfortunately. He's not making the list. Rich Amiri, way past the list. That man blew up in TikTok. It, he, he, he don't need it. Scarlet, I don't know who you are. Shai K, I don't know who you are. GTS, I, I, don't, I don't know you. I don't even know if I said that. Skilla Baby, Skilla Baby Fire. Just got off tour with Travis Scott. Huge look. Detroit, of course, been going absolutely crazy. I could see him making the list. He has a lot of industry push behind him. And just the fact that him going on tour with Travis Scott is like almost enough, in my opinion. I could see him possibly making it. Skrilla. Skrilla's been paving his own way. Paving his own, you know, lane, doing his thing. Shout out to Skrilla. I mean, I don't listen to Skrilla that much. I think he's fire. But I see the movement he'd be having, and I got nothing but respect for it. Sugar Hill, D-Dot, another one of those, like, drill new york shits i i mean i don't think he could make the list xxl is new york based they love their new york artists you know they usually have a little bit of bias there but he's not quite having his own kind of moment this year like a lot of these other people tata i think i've heard the name yeah brooklyn drill probably i don't really listen to him mexican ot man now listen bro i ain't even gonna lie bro mexican ot can rap bro he is funny he can make the bangers, but when he wants to rap, he can rap. I'm waiting to hear him over some, like, Alchemist, like, shit. He needs to link up with some of them, like, Griselda boys, because, dude, he can really rap. He can really rap. I could see him on this list. He has a huge industry push right now. I could see him on the list, and I wouldn't even be mad at it, bro, because he low-key kind of deserves that. Toby, I fuck with Toby. I'm not too huge on Toby's music personally, but he's been making a name for himself. V's, V's just don't even... V's, you would be... A... You're way too you're way too good. You're way too good. You're way too big. You know, this list should not even be on your mind. I don't think it is. I don't think he would accept, but V's you know, if if they put V's in the cipher in the freestyle, he's smoking everyone there, is all I got to say. But V's ain't accepting that list. And not at all. Wiz having I don't I don't know who you are. Wolfface Joey. Now Wolfface Joey, shout out having a huge moment recently. Shout out Wolfface. He kinda tapped in with me a little bit a while ago, but damn. He has been absolutely pulling through with these singles and stuff recently. I believe his album's dropping soon. He's not having a moment. He's a name I could see on the list. I, I could definitely see him on the list. YTV Fat signed to Yo Gotti, I believe, from Memphis. I believe Yo Gotti. That could be wrong. But he's been going fucking crazy. I've, I've actually enjoyed everything. He's been going out. I'm not sure if he's going to make the list. He does kind of fit that street mold. But, you know, XXL in New York, uh, that street mold, they're going to fill with some New York drill rappers. That's just what's going to happen. Zeddy Will, I don't know who you are. Zo Osama. Zeddy Will, you don't know who Zeddy is. No. <laughs> you don't know who Zeddy is. It's crazy.
And I don't even listen to New York rappers that much, but it'll be fine to have him on there. Oh, he you are. Dirtball? Now, Dirtball should be on the list. But I think he's been having a huge mm -hmm. moment. A huge moment for him, but the thing is, I think Laser's a little bit bigger than him, and I know they're doing their co-headlining tour. I see them in, like, a few weeks, but it's like, if anyone's gonna fit that spot, it's, it's Laser. He's not on this list, so I don't think he's gonna make it regardless. I don't even think he's submitted or anything, but that that's my thoughts on that. Four Bats? Four Bats is huge, bro. <laughs> Number one mixtape in the world. Kanye West feature, Drake feature. He don't need the list. He he don't need the list. He has been having a fucking insane year. 21 Lil Harold, of course, signed to 21 Savage. I love Lil Harold. I have for like two years now, I feel like. He's been killing his shit. I mean, he's been killing it. I don't think he's making the list. I, I don't think he's making it, but I wouldn't be upset if he was on here. And then we have 310 Baby. I don't know who you are. Those are the XXL 10th spot options. I just went through, gave my thoughts now. If we're going to have a list that what, what do I think? What does Bryce think would be the peak list for XXL? Now, this is a perfect world. This is a world where people like XXL. XXL isn't located in New York. XXL doesn't care about numbers as much as they do cultural relevant moments. So we're going to keep these into account. This is a realistic, perfect world example of who I think had the biggest years, who I think had the biggest moments, and such. So we're going to start with Dirtball on there. Come on completely doing his shit. I just talked about him. And of course, I talked about Laser Dem as well. He should be on there. Mm -hmm. I mean, it, it's got to be Laser. It's, Laser's been having a huge year. Same for osama -san. Same for Netspen. I mean, those four have just been running, running shit. And some other people that have been running shit, Molly Santana, get the female representation there because her new album's great. She's been running shit. She's been on tour with all the people I just listed. She's been killing it. Another person who's been on tour with those people who's been killing shit too, Yapo JJ. Come on. Huge year. I mean, these are these names are like the underground powerhouses. You guys know that. So that's what I'm going for here. Baby Kia as well. Absolutely exploding onto the scene. Literally, he, he needs to be on there. Bear One Boss had a monumental year. I mean, from all the cosigns and collabs we've been doing, being locked up with Cardi, bro, he is having his moment. All eyes are on him now. Anisia, I mentioned earlier, some more female representation in there. She's been absolutely killing I don't know what the hell he going on about, but I don't, I ain't know most of these people, but um yeah, that's the video. I don't think XXL Cypher like people really care about it. But in my world, you'll see Huncho, you'll see Laser Den, you'll see um Mexican OT, you'll see what who 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 You'll see um BK the Ruler. You'll see Zeddy Will. I can't think of nobody else, but, um, yeah, I don't know. Let's see if it's hitting on something, but it's your boy OGT Man signing out. Yeah.